Yes, 24th of May was always the opening day, and uh, the tradition was to go out by the old fort on the golf course, I do not Fort George, but Fort Mississauga, out on the golf course, and go in what uh, we can call euphemistically Bear Bottom Creek. <laughs> it was usually pretty cold on the 24th of May, but that was uh, the day that we would usually start our season. If we had to play hooky from school, we'd play hooky from school to go out and, and make the 24th of May as our first day of swimming. There was the movie in town which at the Royal George. Silent movies in those days. With a succession of pianists, Isla Brennan and Eleanor Masters, playing the piano. And they adjusted the movie, the, the, whatever they were playing, to the action on the screen. They watched the screen, and if there was an action cowboy picture, they were playing cowboy music. And if there was a love scene, they were playing uh, soft, romantic music. And the big deal was to take the girl to the movie and sit in the balcony on Saturday nights, missing 25 cents. The big deal was as far as the summertime entertainment was concerned, was when the boats were running to Toronto. They had three of them. In those days, the Kiyuga, the Chippewa, and the Corona. The Chippewa was an old side wheeler, and each of them made a couple of trips a day. And the opening day of the season, was the, all with the free trip, they took all the kids in town and anybody else that wanted to go up to Queenston and back as a free trip. And that was the big excitement where you lined up at the dock to get the free ride up to Niagara, up to Queenston and back. Mm 